For centuries, art has served to recognize, reflect, and reinforce the reputations and the stories of those who hold power. Portraits of kings on horseback, politicians posing, the great and the good, and usually the white and the male. But in the art of Kahinde Wiley, he seeks to reroute this power. He turns the traditional back on itself and instead serving those who are marginalized, ordinary or unheard. Often in his work, Wiley casts unknown black sitters from the street to take the place of emperors, warriors and men of industry. Wiley's subjects also inhabit the power of those they have replaced. In the artist's own words, he says, in a world so unmasterable and so unknowable, you give the illusion or veneer of the rational, of order, these strong men, these powerful purveyors of truth. And so this thing that I do is in a strange sense being drawn toward that flame and wanting to blow it out at once. In 2017, Wiley made Naranshif, his first ever video installation, expanding his practice from painting to film and experimenting with visual poetry. Naranschiff, which is German for Ship of Fools, is a three-channel digital film projection acquired by The Box. It is a direct reference to the 15th century book of the same title by the German theologian Sebastian Brandt. The video work is accompanied by the original 1498 book, The Ship of Fools by Brandt, which is part of The Box's designated Cotonian collection. This book is a satire of politicians, clerics and other well-known or influential people. It was a huge success at the time, narrating the story of a crew of fools lost at sea. The Ship of Fools is not, however, an imaginary story. It is estimated that in the 13th century in Western Europe, large numbers of the population were made to set sail and forced into sanatoriums, labelled as outsiders. The idea of marginalising those who do not conform to societal norms is what Wiley wants us to reflect upon through his work. His film is a portrait of a group of black men at sea, struggling to reach the land, a metaphor for both historical and contemporary histories of migration. The script of the work is voiced by actress CCH Pounder and blends the philosophy of Michel Foucault's Madness and Civilization with that of Franz Fanon's The Wretched of the Earth. Both books explore the debilitating effects of mental illness on those colonized or oppressed. The figures in the film are fishermen and their families from Haiti. Their bodies move through the water, drifting, swimming, fishing and sailing. While the traditional trope of the Ship of Fools is a dark, mad, tragic one, Wiley's Naranshef is by turns troubling and beautiful sparkling and full of hope for a better, more equal, more compassionate world. <laughs>